Hello, Scorpio. It looks like you have two people here to choose from. What kind of outcomes will they bring? Let's dig in to see where this goes. <music> Hello everyone, welcome in. This is a Scorpio tarot reading. It's a general reading, usually between two energies, but if more are involved, they usually pop up. Let's dig in to see what sort of theme we have for you today. Ooh, the call, number one, honor the whisper of your soul. 10,000 angels. Number 17 reduced to an eight. Lean on your inner circle. Lean on your circle of supernatural support. Big call to higher self and spirit team references here, Scorpio, which I'd imagine, considering how intuitively connected that you y'all tend to be, it's a clear signal. <laughs> so if you reach into a point of abundance that's getting close to an end of a cycle, going from one to eight, let's see what's happening. Show me what's happening with Scorpio, please. Oh, okay. It stopped. There was there was a cycle to achieve a certain. Okay, there was a cycle here to achieve a certain amount of material wealth a specific sort of lifestyle and 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 it was brought to a halt let's see what's going on got it okay knight of wands there underneath page of cups ten of cups knight of cups king of pentacles taurus energy knight of swords Two of Pentacles, Eight of Swords. Okay, so let's get a little closer here. There's, I'm going to read this side as you, Scorpio. This is the person you're connecting with. This is the situation. So here's the thing. There's two people here. You have two knights, right? Um, one, okay. Got it. So this... Knight of Swords. The Knight of Swords here is the Danger Kitty. <laughs> and with the Eight of Swords right underneath that. So there's there's one knight here. Okay. Got it? Okay. Um, I'm feeling very that have your cake and eat it too energy. Okay. Um Someone's used to always having all options is how it's coming through. Okay. I can see how the King of Pentacles would be used to something like that. Sure. Especially with the Ten of Cups here and the Two of Cups, the Two of Pentacles at the bottom. So there's, there's a situation here where very little emotion was actually put into. I, it feels like either you didn't see this Knight of Swords for who they truly are. Or they chose, they chose to blindfold themselves from you. Because it looks like you chose this Knight of Cups. Because this Knight of Cups is making off with your cup. Okay. There's, um, got it. Okay. Dude, they're holding that cup like, look what I got. It's my trophy. Okay. The thing is, is that this, this is very little emotional connection being given to whoever you deemed worthy the winner something like that but this means this is a call okay so there was a call here to choose to choose you stuck with cups but for some reason there's there's something here with this knight of swords eight of swords or either you refused to see them clearly 
or they refuse to blindfold themselves to not see you anymore. Okay, both of those concepts could exist in the same storyline, sure. Um, so this was this was a test. This was Knight of Wands underneath the Lovers, Five of Swords, Hierophant, Card of Taurus, Hermit, Six of Cups. Ah, there was a chance. There was a chance to be revealed a soulmate. There was a chance for a soulmate to be revealed here. And it did, it did not. There's Ten of Swords down there, too. It did not. Okay. Okay. It did not. It looks like this person turned into the magician that's under here and manifested themselves a new path. So, the Knight of Cups was what was chosen. Let me see what this whole situation was. Let's get some details on this Page of Cups, please. Two of Cups... Ten of Wands, Eight of Pentacles, Nine of Pentacles, Hermit, Card of Virgo, The Lovers, oh shit, okay, <laughs> Queen of Cups, so this really was, this Angels here was actually this Hermit, the Hermit is also a guide, leading us out of the darkness with the light of divine knowledge, okay, and she's trying to shine the light on this person see how she's trying to shine the light here on this nine of pentacles that's actually your lover that has the heart space okay trying to get you to see what this nine of pentacles person is could be at your work eight of pentacles to nine of pentacles okay um for some reason you viewed this two of cups as burdensome so what, what, what was what was the problem show me the problem with the ten of wands Oh, you're the boss, huh? Ah, pre-established home with someone else. You could you could have either you're the boss or owner of the business, or you have also moved you have given some to this Knight of Cups and have now moved in, possibly married. So you're already in something. Okay. And then this person came in. Okay. Show me the Ten of Cups for Scorpio, then. Empress, Four of Pentacles, Emperor. Wow. Is it really the Ten of Cups, though? Or, or what, hold, holding... Okay, let's back up. <laughs> Empress, Card of Taurus, and Libra, Emperor, Card of Aries. Show me the Four of Pentacles only. Ah, uh, mm, and the Ten of Cups, just the Ten of Cups. The truth is what? Mm. Staying for the kids? Got two pages underneath the deck there. So, holding on to this situation. Holding on with Dear Life, Four of Pentacles Strength card. Despite the fact that it may be a connection that is, that there is no longer any emotional attachment in it. Okay, so this is telling me that the Ten of Cups with the Ace of Swords, Six of Cups, King of Swords, Six of Pentacles, this is, this is telling me this Ten of Cups looks happy. It looks happy from the outside looking in. Okay, it, it looks happy. It's a little cold. There's a little bit of a detachedness here. Um, this other person could have been a soul bond too. And this could have been like your choice of, do I pick this soul bond or this soul bond? And one could have been a karmic and one could have been a soulmate. You may have picked the karmic. Which could be why the abundance is stopping. Okay. So it looks really nice. Emperor, Empress, Ten of Cups, holding on to it for dear life because of how it looks. Show me the King of Pentacles here. This is Taurus energy, please. There's that magician. Seven of Wands, four out three of Wands. Ah, not wanting it to be over. Waiting to see what comes in next. Okay. 
there's this tells me king of pentacles magician seven of wands trying to hold off the closing of the world you have an extremely strong will scorpio you have held on to this situation that you've made your life template so hard and you've just managed to that tells me you have an extremely strong will in order to hold on to basically the throne of emperor to maintain order that you for whatever reason believe you have to maintain okay but this cycle is closing and there's something else coming in actually no you're watching them now very interesting story guys show me the two of pentacles please this person exited, now you're wondering where they went. Got it. King of Wands, Leo Energy. Three of Cups. Oh, did you say that they're just a friend? There you are, they're on the bottom. Did, did you say? Well, well, we could just be, they could just be a friend that I'm super attracted to. And I could just tell them that as I'm leaving. Like, yeah, it's nothing serious. Oh, we're just friends. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. Let's see what's going on on this side, shall we? Let's start with the Knight of Cups that's made off with the cup. The world's priestess, Pisces energy. Magician, Ten of Coins. Ah. So they, they know that in, uh, then, try this again. They know that in winning you, they will be sitting pretty for life. You must generate some serious income or lifestyle. They know, okay, that they no longer have to do anything. The world, their venture as a knight is over. They, they don't get, they don't have to excel to a king or a queen or an emperor or an empress because it looks good. It looks fine. Okay. And their 10 of coins, long-term support and stability is secure. Now show me the knight of swords. You don't see them. The moon, more Pisces energy. Two of coins. Hangman, eight of coins. awakening ah ha, ha ha if this person wasn't an active practicing healer before they are now so this person it, that's interesting that's really really interesting so um uh i think in the bible it says um that the next coming of christ he will come like a thief in the night that's actually the phrase that came out when looking at the moon at the Knight of Swords. I don't mean to spark any resistance to anyone who isn't into religion. I personally am not, um, but I have read the Bible. Um, that that phrase, he will come like a thief in the night, but it's like they went like a thief in the night. You didn't know that they were gone until they were just gone. It's something, it's a decision that they meditated on for some time. They could have kept the job for a while while they constructed the path that is their exit. And when the exit happened was a point of awakening for them. Okay. So they're not the previous version of themselves that they were when you knew them. Show me the eight of swords, please. Show me the eight of swords. Star, yes. Okay. So this was, ooh, nice. Alchemist Tower. Yes! Knight of Swords there again on the bottom. So Star, Aquarius Energy. This is the end, okay, of allowing confusion in a connection in any capacity and healing the wound that's contingent with that. Um, this was a pretty explosive, let's say. <laughs> Alchemist Tower. Yeah. Um, so it was an inner world change and an outer world change anything else we need to know on this person real quick ten of wands six coins queen of coins king of coins empress 
they have ascended to a new level of being. Again, not the same person. They do travel more. Can you tell us anything about the person Scorpio is with now? Like real motives and feelings? Four of Cups. Ace of Swords, Nine of Wands. Okay, she knew, because this I am getting all this as feminines. She knew, the one you're with, that you had a cup for someone else. And even if you don't show that you're sad about that person being gone, they know you're sad about it. They know that you wait, you wait for them. You walk, you keep it, you keep, that's it. You keep an eye out for them. Interesting. Okay. So, I mean, this person kind of views you as a trophy slash meal ticket, um, I don't want to know what happens with them. <laughs> I'm going to go into the person that you lost in the extended. I'm going to go into them in their current energy, their near future, and the final outcome of the connection between you in this lifetime. Because this abundance is going to grind to a halt. So this Ten of Pentacles isn't going to be secure for this person anymore. So how long do you think they're going to stick around? If that's the goal. Right? So, let's get into the one who has dramatically changed. So, if you're interested in any information on it, um, feel free to follow me by clicking the link in the description box below. And I'll see you guys over there. Bye! Mm -hmm.